Hey, I'm Walt, and I'm back again with another segment on my Waltology page, all right? So, today, I'm going to get into some of the fat shaming, because that's what it is, that I am seeing regarding Lizzo and her most recent performance, all right? So, over the weekend, Lizzo had a performance, you know, and I, and I guess midway through the performance, she wanted to show how flexible flexible she was, you know, let you know, hey, don't let the size fool you. I can lift it up, all right? So you have certain YouTube creators that, I guess, took offense to that. You had some of them out there talking about she's dusty. Wait a minute, Lizzo Dusty? Come on now, that is wrong. And it's just, it's just not true, right? You can't use the phrase dusty and use that to describe Lizzo, right? Dusty is a grown man north of 40, you know, fat shaming a woman basically half his age that would never give him the time of day. That's dusty. All right. But moving along, the end of the day is that was hypocritical. All right. If this was Megan Thee Stallion, Nicki Minaj, Little Kim 20 years ago, and she was twerking and popping her cheeks and 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 did the same split that Lizzo did. And a butt cheek popped out. No one has a problem. But because Lizzo is a BBW, a big, beautiful woman who has embraced her size and said to herself, you know what? This is who I am and this is what I feel comfortable as. And she wants to come out there and give her fans a good show. Her fans, by the way, that are supporting her and buying her tickets, all right? She has every right to do it, all right? And ultimately, when you take a step back and you look at it, why why hate on her? You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, no one cares if you like what she looks like. You ain't paying for the tickets. You're not a fan of her music, right? So to me, it's all hypocritical because if she fit your aesthetic, you would not have any problem, uh, any dance move, any aero uh, aerobic movement that she does on the stage. You would ask for more. So to me, let's stop the, the hate. Let's stop the fat shaming. Let's live and let live. All right. If you want to do something, instead of criticizing um, Lizzo, instead of talking about what she should do and not do in performances that you're not going to pay to go see anyway, focus on you, you know. A lot of y'all, y'all talking about Lizzo and, and, and apparently, you know, you're not the biggest fans of, of having a few extra pounds. So if that is the case, look in the mirror, pick up the, the double chin. Some of y'all got a triple chin, jiggle it a little bit and work on a plan to get rid of it. All right. I'm Walt with another segment of Waltology. Please like, please share, please subscribe and let me know what you think.